Good morning, boys and girls. Hope you're doing great today. Miss Dana wishes you well. I'm giving you all a hug. Air hug, air hug, air hug. About a high five. Fist bump. Do a little dance. I'm greeting you this morning. Whichever greeting you would prefer. We are going to have circle time today. And I'm glad you all have joined me this morning. I'm glad that you're here. We are going to do a little review of what you learned before school was out. If you remember, we were talking about dinosaurs. We're going to see what you guys remember today. But first, we're going to review our number, our shape, and our letters, and our color that we were doing. So, let's look at our number that we were working on. Alright, can you tell me what this number is? Number nine. That's the numeral nine. There's nine dots. And this is the word nine. Let's count them together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Good job. Way to count. Can you tell me what number comes before the nine? Eight. What about the number that comes after nine? If you were counting... What would you say after you said nine? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's what you would say. All right, let's look at this shape. What is this shape? It does look like an egg. Looks like you've stretched out a circle. It's called an oval. No matter which way you turn it, okay, if we squish it down, it would be a circle. But we pulled out that circle to make this oval. And all the sides are rounded. There's no corners on an oval. And what about the color? Green. That is our color for March. And there's a lot of green outside right now. The grass is growing. The flowers are getting ready to start growing. Some of them are growing if you have bloomed because it is springtime now. That happened on the 20th of March. So we're going to have lots of stuff growing outside. Lots of beautiful things. So let's look at our letters. What about this letter right here? N. What sound does it make? N. Nickin. Nico, nice, no, good, very good. All right, what about this letter? W, W, and it goes, ooh, wagon, wheel, when, where, why, Williams. What about this letter? This is a new letter. The other two are reviews. This is the new letter for the week. Why? This is the capital, by the way, and the lowercase. And it goes, y y yikes, yellow, yo-yo, yay, yes. Can you think of some words that the letter Y would start with? Remember that y y sound. All right, now let's move on to talk about dinosaurs. That's what we were talking about. That's what this word says, dinosaurs. And these are some different types of dinosaurs. We talked about them last week. Miss Dana has some here, dinosaurs. That's the Triceratops. We have a T-Rex, Tyrannosaurus Rex. We have a pterodactyl that flies through the sky. We have a host of others too that you guys um, have been able to play with throughout the center. And they will still be here when you get back. But let's talk about some things that you remember about dinosaurs or that you already knew. Okay, I have up here dinosaur facts. 
and we're going to list some dinosaur facts that you may have remembered. I remember some things you told Miss Tina. Do you remember some things that you told Miss Tina before we left? One of them had to do with are dinosaurs still on the earth today? Do we see dinosaurs in real life walking around unless we go to a museum or somewhere where there's a statue or on TV if there is a show or a cartoon? No, because they no longer live on this earth. Now, can you tell me what the word is that means they no longer are alive, no longer living? Extinct. All right, yes. Dinosaurs are, I'm going to put short, I'm going to put dinos. How's that? That's a short version for dinosaurs. Dinos are extinct. That means they no longer live on earth. They're no longer alive. So, I remember you telling Miss Tina that. So, what's another fact that you remember about dinosaurs? They can be very big. Yeah, some dinosaurs, some, I'm just going to put the some, are big. What's another word for big? Huge. Yes, huge. Some are huge. Some could be as big as our school building, remember? We talked about that. But then there's also some that are the opposite of huge or big. That means they're totally different. So what is the opposite of huge? Small. I don't know about that small. But there were some that were very small. So we will put some were small. Let me change that word too. Small were were because they're no longer here. Okay, now who remembers what dinosaurs eat? Can you tell me what they eat? What do dinosaurs eat? Plants, that's right. This dinosaur here, we believe, brontosaurus, ate plants. This long neck they had, because these were some huge dinosaurs, and this long neck that they had allowed them to reach up into the trees and get leaves from the tallest part of the tree or they could eat plants off the ground. And these were some slow moving dinosaurs, they do believe. So, all right. So, we're going to put plants, they ate plants. Do you remember what that was called? If you are a plant eater, do you remember what you are? An herbivore. That is correct. So, we're going to put some eight plants. What did you say? Some ate what? Meat. Yes. And that means they ate what? <laughs> Other dinosaurs. That is correct. That's the only meat that there was out there at the time. So, some ate meat. They were called what? Were they called if they eat meat? What was the word? Carnivores, yes, so some were carnivores, and so some ate meat. Good job. Okay, now dinosaurs had little dinosaurs, they had babies, and so what did they do? Something about having the babies. They laid eggs, yes. Some dinosaurs laid eggs. Just like, what lays eggs today? What animals do we have that lay eggs today? Can you name them for me? Chickens, yes. What else? Turtles, right. Snakes, mm-hmm. And what is the main one we know that lay eggs? Birds, yes. So we're going to talk about dinosaur eggs later this week. We're going to talk about the sizes and maybe list some more animals that lay eggs. And we're going to talk about how did that work for a dinosaur, especially huge dinosaurs 
when they laid eggs. We're going to talk about that. So y'all come up with some good facts this morning about dinosaurs. They're extinct. Some were huge. Some were small. Some ate plants. Some ate meat. Some had eggs. And there's other facts that I know you guys told Miss Tina before we left. And if you think of any of those and you want to let me know them, share them with me. Just tell me about it. Have the grown-up that's with you type them in and say, Hey, Miss Dana, here's some more facts that I know about dinosaurs. And we can share those with everybody else. So, you guys have a great rest of your day. I hope you enjoy all these videos. I miss you so much. I'm giving you a big hug from afar. And I hope to see you soon. But until we are back together again in person, Miss Dana will be making these videos for you. And I really, really hope you enjoy watching them. Love you guys very much.